Hello everybody, Game of Life 64 in here. In the last episode, we geared up here, bought some items here, to prepare for the search for Yukiko, who we believe may be indeed inside the TV. But in the midst of all that, we've also learned about a thing here in the vote room, about fusing personas. But we will get deeper into that later. For now, we will head to Juness. Remember that you're supposed to meet food court. Yes, yes. Head to Juness. And here we go. To the food court, our base of operations. I love this music. I hope that's picking up. The sale should end soon, so that'll get rid of some of the people wandering around here. If not here, allow me. Don't want this too loud, though. A bit late. Gee, it's not too late to... I'm going. <laughs> not gonna stop, Chie. Fine, but don't push yourself. Got it? She's a tomboy for Pete's sake, man. And back in we go. This time with Chie in tow. And Teddy, whoa. You look confused. Oh, it really is that bear from last time. But in actuality, well, he's just what are thinking. You doing? Can't you tell? I'm thinking about stuff. Empty head and he's thinking. Yeah, he's in deep thought, I'm sure. <laughs> I've been deliberating ah. for a long time now. Hey, that wasn't a bad joke. Hee <laughs> hee. Ugh. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so, did you figure anything out? Nope. Uh, it's probably useless to think about it too much. I've seen the inside of your skull, and it was empty. How rude. How rude. <laughs> I've got to stop doing that. <laughs> You're right, though. I try and try, but nothing comes out of my head. Will you guys shut up? Now's not the time for stupid jokes. Listen. Someone came here yesterday, right? Yeah, it's great. Wow. At least we think so. There's a girl with a better nose hmm. than me? What's your name, miss? Miss? <laughs> oh, I'm Since kidding. she's never been but called never before. Mind that. Tell me more about that someone. I think it happened a little after I talked with you guys. After that, it felt like someone was here. Is it Yukiko san? He doesn't know. I don't know. I haven't looked. Of course. The presence is over that way. That's probably where they are. Over there, huh? And she recklessly runs learning? off. Yeah. Uh, of course. <laughs> and here's what I call like the first dungeons of the game. Though we won't delve too deep into it, welcome to Yukiko's castle. You have a set time limit for these dungeons. You think this is the place they showed on TV? The also? true star of this place will start on the 18th and you have up until a week You're positive that to no finish. A camera for that or the person you try to rescue will die. Now what I'm gonna try and what I'm gonna do is grindings will be done on and off screen, of course, because I do want you guys to go with me in some of the grinding just for fun. And also what I'm gonna do when I play this normally, I've beaten these places, all of the dungeons, including the final boss, not the final final, but the final boss. Three days. I may do that here, I may not. I might give you guys a good experience, but I won't like go like, oh look, one day left me do this. Be all like, oh look, last minute, nah. I don't know. <laughs> Thanks, Teddy. But you know what, I'm, I'll debate about when we get to that point, but grinding will be done on and off screen, as I said. Because the first time Yuki 
As far as how many days I'll do to complete each one, um, given how high I grind, I might just do the three days. I'm not sure. Probably change my mind as I go along with this. Good old lemonade. Is this kind of like what happened to me last time? There's a lot of stuff I still don't get, but after hearing your story, I think that program happens because of the person who appears on it, or something like that. Meh, Teddy's sort of getting it. So Yukiko is producing that show herself? Ah, I don't get this at all. Yeah, we'll get more into that later. Six minutes in. Uh, well, maybe we'll get a good look inside the castle. Oh, by the way, each dungeon in this game has different levels. Or I should say floors. This dungeon has eight floors. The main boss, the person you rescue, is at the top. You... You will have... A mini boss on your way to the final boss. But well, I'll explain once we get inside. But that's pretty much just a bit. On your way up, there'll be mini bosses on the way to the final boss. And that's usually on the fourth or fifth floors. I can't remember. That's been a while. But what you want to do here first before you go in, Teddy will give you something. He'll give you a revival bead. And he'll also give you peach seed and draw the. Uh, uh, can't speak there. Anyway, let's go in. Starve our castle to get Chie. By the way, outside there's when you pick and change your party members when you get more of them. What are we at? 726? Not bad. Here we are, our first stop. Now, firstly, before anything, what you want to do, Teddy's busy explaining shadows, how to get a jump on them by hitting first. The so first thing, so what I want to do here is you want to talk to Teddy. You want to change tactics. You're going to want to do this. You want to have... You want to direct the commands of the AI. Because sometimes they won't always do what you want. You want to give them... You don't want to have them any free activeness. You want to get them here. Chest, this is where you get items. Like Vanish Ball, that's to run from battle. Those are very handy. Here we go, move on in. This is floor one. Not much to say here. What I usually do is I like to explore throughout before I move on. I think that's just a room though with a chest in, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, oh and here we go, I'll let you have our first battle. Usually if you hit first, I get, you get the advantage of hitting. Here's Yosuke's stairs. He's got wind and a physical attack, and this is a healing ability. Here's his standard attack. Good damage. I want to save my energy for as much as I can because this is we go. Oh, here's the cards Igor talked about. Here we go. Perfect. The glass ones do nothing. The red ones take away all items and money and experience you get in the battle. When you defeat an enemy, the seeds of possibility you attain will appear before you as cards. At times, they may be hard to grasp, but you must master your fear and reach out to them. And here we go, shuffle time. I want the pixie in the bottom middle. Here we go. Oh, still got it. Got ya. Ah! Oh, well, that's good, I'll take that, doesn't matter. They basically just used for fusions, more or less. Oh, and also... Level up, which you'll do fairly early on in the game. You'll do that easily. What I should do while we're on the subject... If I can do it... Here we go, yes. This is where you also look at the stats of only yourself. Which is this. You also get the stats of party members. 
and when they're next to level up. There we go, we'll get a chest here. Lifestone. That's pretty much to revive a bah, camera, excuse me. I'm doing that, I'm not meaning to. Careful now, there's also something to get stuck in walls if you do that. Another shadow. Ah, oh, still didn't give it to me. Only three of them. What we'll do first, we'll take out one at a time. Because I want you at least some to get... Oh, good! If you get a crit like this, you get a... You get another free turn. But then they also get to attack. They don't do much, as you saw there. Uh, they're doing minimal damage at best. Still a pain. Here we go. Early on, these are pretty easy, but later they'll get difficult. Oh, and I should mention that when we grab the personas. Here, hold on! Oh, sorry about that. I bumped it. We didn't lose much time. You didn't miss anything. I just stood here. Oh, no, 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 not Ted, not Ted. I'm so sorry, that was embarrassing. What you're gonna do is you're going here. This is where you'll see your personas and what they can do. This will do wind damage. This is to take out rage, confusion, and fear. This to lower chances of death. Fire. Three turns. Confusion. More or less these are for, fu for fusion purposes. I don't use these small ones. I'll use my main guy here. Where are we at? 12-12. This is the way it leads to the next floor. There's nothing here. Or if I'm not mistaken, yeah, this is to the next floor. Right here. Yes, so what we're going to do is I'll take out the shadow. One lonely shadow. Down. Congratulations, Jess. We're going to heal up here. Just because. I did getting the buttons mixed up. I want to hit triangle for this. Items. Take our medicines, heal up. Now what we want to do, before we head up, like I said, I have to clear everything before we continue. Like the items and such. Ah, I hate doing that. Wanna be careful on corners because there might be shadows. There you go, player advantage, we get to attack first. That's what I wanted to show. Oh, and these things are weak to wind. If I'm not mistaken, if I remember these things don't like wind, which Yosuke comes in handy for that. Yes. And that really show now you have party members. You can do all in one attack, like this. That just total combined damage. That should level up Yosuke, if I'm not mistaken. No, not yet. With that, though... On our way to the top. Sorry for the embarrassment. I'll cut it off here. I'm GameFlow64. See you in the next one.